Hi, my name is Sankar Caro, and this is the second video in a series leading up to an interview we did with Linda Moulton Howe. And I'm going to share a clip with you today where she talks about tall whites and also telepathy. Now, in video one, we talked about how she came to the understanding after talking with a government official. Now remember, Linda Moulton Howe has developed relationships with government officials, aerospace companies, and the likes for decades and decades. She's built trust with them as well. And in these next two video clips, in this one and the next one, she's gonna be talking about grays and tall whites and what her understanding is and what she's been told about how they operate. Check it out. The tall whites are supposed to be spiritual. They are supposed to acknowledge souls. They are supposed to have families. They are supposed to love their children to the point that they would stop a human heart in an individual because they can control brains. If you cross a certain geophysical line that has been established, this is tall white territory. And at the same time, I have been able to interview a man who was a manager, now retired, in an aerospace corporation, who said, Linda, I worked elbow to elbow with a tall white. He said, you can feel the energy that comes off of them. And then he said, the, the closest thing I could possibly say to you that would give you a sense of what it is like to work with and communicate with a tall white extraterrestrial. He said, it's like being with a human who had five Cray supercomputers for a brain. And then he said, the tall whites literally project their mind into time lines. They are honestly trying to help us. The tall whites are honestly trying to help us. But they are so advanced so far beyond even a human ability to even say, how would you extend your mind into timelines, find problems, neutralize problems, change the present, the past, and the future? And that's what the tall whites do. How do we communicate when we have been kept so dumb and blind for millennia? And now it's really important because the whole future of our planet may rest on humans beginning to learn how to know anything about the tall whites. The Nordics, one man who was in the Air Force said, people should at least be told that the Vikings, that were considered to be one of the greatest gladiator type fighters on the planet of the Earth, Linda, those are full bore Nordic ETs. The Vikings of history were full bore Nordic ETs on our planet, known as great warriors. Why can't we know this as a fact announced by the governments of the world? Our history is not exactly what you think, and we're now going to start educating you for real. Yeah. How are we going to get out of this 2020 to 2030 decade? that is tumultuous politically, seismically, every other way, yeah. if we are not told the truth honestly. Hi, I want to invite you to put like and subscribe right now on this channel because this information is fascinating and it's really what has been leaked out from all of the classified information that we have no access for. So thank goodness for Linda Moulton Howe for these loose lips that have shared some of this information so that we can come and talk and have opinions and discuss what we think about them. I invite you to leave a comment below and also join us November 2nd for the release of Linda Moulton Howe's video.